Yeah. yeah. It was a lot of um, financial difficulty. And of course, you also wanted to send uh, David. You <laughs> wanted to send him to work. And there was a tremendous fight because the mother, Silvia's mother, said, David, David has got a talent. You're not going to take him out of school. But it wasn't only that. It, this was in a day when, you know, not very many people went to university. Really, you went if you were extremely clever. Very few people just, it wasn't just an accepted norm. Oh, you leave school and you go to university, you know. As so many people seem to do much more today. But yes, the um, schoolmaster called, yes. his, called Sika's father. And he said, no way would you take him out of school. No, he actually begged him, he said. He's got great potential. Mm. And he took quite a fight with, with, his, uh, with, with her father to stop sending him to work when he was very young. And of course, he won, he won a, 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 what is it called? A scholarship. A scholarship. Mm. And when he won the scholarship, the father agreed that he should continue his education. And um, of course, later on in life, his father didn't regret that he allowed him to go to school, finish you know, his education. One has to put oneself also in the, as, as you mature, you understand these things. I mean, bitterness could probably be there, you know, when you were young to think, how could a parent even think like that? But you have to remember that that parent also, you know, went out, look at my father, 15 years old, sent out into the world. So, though he appreciated many things, he didn't quite appreciate the fact that um, of the role education, you know, played or should play or could play yeah. in the life, in the life of his children. What did you tell David? You push a barrow. Yes, when he was angry with him. One day you'll push a barrow. But he lived to regret That's saying how that. In the old days. He lived to regret saying Children that. were pushed yeah. out at a very early age to contribute and to work. The family uh, income, of course. It's a different world today. Well, I think parents with even very loving parents sort of looked upon their children in a, as a form of insurance, you know, to... Yeah. Times indeed change. It was different. But it wasn't a household without love. It was a lot of love. 